87 in Houston. That's a cool night. Yeah. I wonder what it is outside tonight here. 76. Hey, guys, it's May May and my trusty sidekick. <laughs> hey, it's Shannon. It's O. Oh, Shannon. Oh, Shannon. Oh, sorry. Shannon. I actually put that in the Facebook. Oops. In the Facebook post, I put oh, me Shannon. and O. Shannon. Um, welcome in. We're going to be assembling this kit tonight, and we're going to do something a little fun. We have 12 giveaways tonight. So we're going to be doing two in the beginning, two at the end, and some sprinkled between cards. Now, if you don't have this card kit, don't stress. You don't. Ha you can follow along by watching. You can participate in the giveaways just by being here. If you want to try to make what we're doing, kind of use it as a layout, that would be fine. But if you have the kit and you're going to be making it along with me, if you would, type a one in the chat and let me know how many people are going to be working with this. I just want to kind of see what we're what we're working like. Now, based on the last kit we put together, we were a little bit slow in our assembly. So we don't want to be that slow this time. And just know if you get behind us, not a big deal. You can catch up. Use, probably while we're doing the giveaways, you'll be able to catch up. So don't worry about it. But let me see how many of you guys are going to be doing this with us. And the giveaways are going to be super fun tonight. Listen, if you don't mind, we would like to see how many viewers we can get on a Friday night. We don't do Friday night lives very much. So we'll see what we can get. So if you want to share the um, the live stream, you can do that. You can share it on Facebook. You can share it over on Instagram. You can say, hey, come watch, whatever. Um, look at all these folks that are here. Here's uh -huh. some ones. We got a lot of folks playing along tonight. Yeah. Oh, no. Diane's having back issues, so she can't sit up to do the work. I'm so sorry. Well, that's just chill and watch. Yeah, just You can enjoy still it. win prizes. Just sit back and enjoy it. Cool. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to start with two giveaways. We think this will be fun. We're going to see how this goes. We're trying something new, and I have to remember how it all works. So you have to give me just a second to figure it all out. But we're going to do what we're calling the spin wheel. So I'm going to turn on the spinning wheel. Look how cute our spinning wheel is. Isn't he cute? We're going to give away two prizes. Okay, here's how we pick who we're pulling for. We decided we were going to let the viewer count tell us, okay? So because there's a lag in the chat, there's always a lag, we pick a number. Do not type anything, okay? We pick a number, and tonight's number, we're going to base the number off of the viewers. So, for example, right now we're going to start a chat, and there are 205 viewers. So we're going to let the first two numbers be what decide which, which commenter we're looking for. So we're going to be looking for commenter number 20, and 21 because we're going to do two prizes okay so there's a word you'll have to say here's how this works i will give you a word you will all comment it shannon will count and the 20th and the 21st person are going to be the ones we get to spin the wheel for okay so are you ready you'll start typing this word when i say it the word you're going to type is spin because tonight we're using the spinny wheel so go ahead now and type the word spin and Shannon will count. And I'm going to tell you when to stop typing because I can tell when she's gotten enough. So type the word spin. Y'all like the little shiny little bright star? He's so He's cute. The cutest. He's so cute, little dancing star. So if you'll just type the word spin, that's your entry. And then Shannon's going to pick 20 and 21. So as we go throughout the night, the number will change because obviously there'll be more viewers coming in. So we are looking for it. Okay, she's got it, so you can stop typing now. And I just want to let you know there is a lag, and people will hear me say that, but still 230 people right now are typing spin, so that's okay. And when it slows down, Shannon can kind of roll back and get it. So while she's doing that, let's talk about what we're giving away tonight. I'm going to be giving away some lapel pins that we did last week. They're not lapel pins. They're enamel pins. Um, we're going to be giving away some of those. We're also going to be giving away three paper packs, three different paper packs tonight, and five stamp sets. So what I'll do is I'm just going to grab something behind me and bring it into camera when we have our two names, and that's how we'll do the spin. So before I get the names, because I want to be fair, I'm going to move this out of the way for a second. Before I get the names, let's grab two prizes. So this one and whatever this is on top. So right now, our first one, oh, you can't see it <laughs> because I have that covering up the screen. I'll show you to the side here. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I can move little spinny guy. Maybe I can move him over and we'll still be able to see it. Yeah, so there's what I'm going to be giving away. This is the Dots and Stripes Copper Full Pack, and it is six 12 by 12 double-sided paper. So that's what we're giving away using the spinny wheel. And who's our first person? Who's winning the first one? Tony Young. Tony Young. All you got to do is type the word here and let me know you're here and that you heard it. And when you do, I'm going to click the little spinny wheel and we'll spin it 
and um, time out. I have to do one more thing. No, I don't. That's right. So what it lands on, you could win this 12 by 12, or you could win this stamp set. This is the first one we're going to give away, or the enamel pen. Oh, I saved one out. <laughs> or an enamel pen. So that's the things it's going to land on. And I want to go ahead before we ever spin the wheel and like pull the prizes so you know what you're going to win. So as Tony said here, there's Tony. There's a here. All right, we're going to spin the wheel and we'll see which one of these goes home with you. All right. So spin little wheel. It even has sound effects. Can you hear the sound effects? We love the sound effects and we love the spinning wheel. Look, he clapped. Did you see him clap? Look, he's so cute. All right, here it goes. Where's it going to stop? Or should I say win? <laughs> Mine hadn't even started spinning. Who's our second person? Uh, Mary Landers. Mary Landers. Go ahead and type here in the chat because you're next. Tony, you won the lapel pin. You won the little um, Distress Ink speckled Yay. egg. That's awesome. So Shannon's going to write down your name. And what I need you to do is I need you to email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com and give her your mailing address so we can get this in the mail to you. All right. So in the next one, we'll do the same thing. We'll give these away and we'll pull, we'll see what goes first or what goes out. Are we going to do Mary? All right. Yeah, we're going to do Mary. Should I, should I do the same two we're doing and just add another little yeah. pin or should we make a second? Okay. We'll do that. So we the same two. We run out. Oh, you still have a little. Yeah, I'll show this one. All right. So, all right. She's here. Did she say here? I see a lot of Mary here, Landers Mary. here. Okay. Mary's here. So Mary, you're either going to win the dots and stripes copper full the stamp set or the enamel pin. Are you ready? We're gonna spin the wheel for you. Here it goes. This is Mary's spin. A Little different than Granny this week. We'll bring Granny back another time, but I thought we'd try something different. This is kind of a neat little thing. And um, we wanted to try the spinny wheel. We like it. Plus that little star, how can you say no? We need to name our star. Spin star. <laughs> star spin. All right, where are we at? What are we landing on? We're landing on the paper pack. That's awesome. Yay. So Dots this is yours. Stripes. So Mary, this is yours. And all I need you to do is email Shannon and let her know your mailing address. That's all we need to do. We'll get that in the mail to you. All right, so since that one's gone, I'm going to put it over here. And we'll have we'll keep showing the lapel pin. So, all right, we have a stamp set for the next one. And there's our lapel pin. Okay, that's our first giveaway. So that's how we're going to be doing giveaways all night long. Okay. And what we'll do is we're going to make two cards and do two giveaways. Make two cards, do two giveaways. I think it'll be fun. All right. To the kit, Batman. Here we go. Here. Oh, that's cute. Bright. The star. Oh, I like bright. Um, spinny star. Spinny bright star. So here's the kit. If you have the kit, you want to go ahead and pull it out and get it all opened up. And I hope you've already looked at your little instructions right here and you've pulled out your paper trimmer, your scissors, your adhesive, your dimensional foam, your wet glue, your baby powder, your ruler, a 3.25 inch circle punch. We'll see how that's going to go. Black twine and black thread. Okay. Or something comparable. This is my twine and thread. Black beggar's twine. That's what I'm going to use. All right. I'm going to take my pages out. And as always, I'm going to hand the instructions to Shannon. Because oh, Shannon is going to read our instructions to us. All right. Oh, good. All the cards are all the cards. Oh, I like all these little short things. They're very short, I noticed, in this, this one. This is very short compared all the to cards the are just an A2 card, which I really like. So I'm going to put those to one side. And I know I'm going to need sheet one. Go ahead and grab sheet one. I got to get a trimmer. Here it is. <laughs> okay, sheet one. All right. Card one is December 25th. Uh, from sheet one... Trim the 4.25 inch by 5.5 inch ornament red black check piece. Oh, it's a whole piece. Ornament red Let me black see. check piece. <laughs> Let me see. I haven't found the card yet. Oh, it's in the middle. That's so interesting. Ornament red black check piece. Oh, that is cute. See, there's a line right here. I'm assuming I need it too. Yeah, unless I cut it wrong. Yeah. <laughs> or laid it on the So paper it's wrong. interesting. I'm going gonna, gonna to get this off and we'll Let's see how see it what goes. It says. So we're going to cut this little piece out here in the corner. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I do need it? Yeah. All right, let's cut this little piece out. Didn't quite get it. Got it. Felt it move. All right, so now what do I do? All right, you're going to trim the red strip off mm -hmm. because it says to adhere the red black, red, black, and check piece to the front of your card 
front opening at the right. Okay. Because I'm fit guessing that's the size of your card front. Probably. All right, so opening at the right means we want to fold it this way. And I'm going to get my bone folder to crease that down. Just like so. All right, so my opening's at the right. So I'm going to glue this directly down, it said. Yes, ma'am. Very good, very good. Oh, look how cute that is. That is cute. Gosh, I like that. Let's go. Come on, glue. I just said, that the glue let me test my glue. It's had a little bit of a thingy in there, and now it's doing it. I tested it, and then it wants to be, it wants to be grumpy. It wants to be grumpy. It's tired, and it wants to go home. It's been a long day for us. <laughs> We've been here it's all been day. Week. We've been packing your sale packages most of the day. It's been a long day. Oh. So if they're wrong, it's our fault. It's our fault. I just moved on. All right, from sheet one, you're going to trim the 2.25 inch by 5.5 inch strip of red. That, that strip. Little buoy. Mm -hmm. And you're going to adhere it vertically to the center of the card. That's cool. I didn't show y'all. It's interesting why they didn't just print it that way. That yeah, I think I'm in the right spot. That cute little card right there. I'll show you two up close. It is interesting why they didn't just print this like this. Yeah. Maybe like. for dimension. So there you go. Then from sheet two, cut, punch, die, cut the 3.25 inch black circle. That's why they wanted you to have a die. I'm not pulling out a die. Trim that thing and cut I'm it. I'm going to cut it. And then you're going to adhere it to the center of the card using foam adhesive. Am I going to be sad that I'm doing this? I don't think so. So you're cutting it? No. You, you always guys, tell everybody fussy cut. I'm not. I just don't want to pull out my whole machine and on my plates and find my dye for one circle. No, Shannon is not dieting, but I did start drinking protein shakes every day for breakfast, and it has helped me lose, helped me to lose some weight. She Thank did. you. The doctor was like, girl. No, the doctor wasn't. You just no, I was. Scale. She was like, hey. Whoa. Our and breakfast it, habits have greatly changed. Yes, greatly changed. I'm not doing jacks and donuts every morning. Makes a difference. It Look does. Look how much faster this is than pulling out all that stuff. Yeah. Just driving these scissors around. No, I'm not using my fussy cut scissors because I feel like I can do this faster with these long blades. Down, down, down. Come on, come on. We don't have a circle punch that is quite that large. I don't have a three and a quarter inch circle punch. So. And that's weird because I have lots of punches. <laughs> but that's a that's a very large that's a, size. It's a large punch. That took 37 seconds, not even that long, maybe. Adhere it to the center of the card using foam adhesive. Foam tape, please. Here's some oh, foam. little Scotty. Yeah, a little Scotty Scotty. Oh, we have 400 viewers. Thank you guys for sharing. Ooh. And if you're here tonight for the first time and you subscribe, your name will flash up on our screen. Ooh. If you've never subscribed to our channel, you should because it's really cute. What are Jack's? Well, well, Jack's is a restaurant that I don't know if it's just in the southeast. I think, yeah, because it's then their slogan like the best of yeah, the south or best something. Best of the south. Center, center. Center, center. Okay. I think that's what I said. Yes, to the center of the card. Center, center. That's where um, that dude's going. Then you're going to locate the December 25th and candy strip stickers and apply baby powder to the back of each layer and adhere them to the black circle using foam adhesive. Or, as May May likes to do, stick them straight to the black circle. I'm not using double layer of foam. I'll put one layer of foam on my car, but I never do two. That's what this you're This is the December 25th. That, this is yep. beautiful. Yep. Wow. Yes, but um, Jack's is a fast food restaurant. Oh, the peppermints. <gasps> They're and so cute. They have the best breakfast. So this goes across all. the bottom of this black circle. Y'all, this is so cute. Very. And, and then, then this goes at the top. Uh -huh. Now you can, let me show y'all. Oh, I didn't get my powder tool down. Hang on. Got to get up here. Where is my powder tool? Oh, it fell. <laughs> well, sometimes they do want powder, and um, May May does not do powder. She revolts sometimes. I do this right here. My powder tool, and look, I leave a little crime scene behind. And I put your towel at the end of your desk. My, this is like, this should be in the Guinness Book of World's record for how long can you use a towel without washing it. It's gross, Janet. It's yeah. gross. All right, I put a little bit of powder, top and bottom, and I'm going to add a little glue just in case I missed anything here. Oh, yes, Miss Betty. They do a delicious biscuits and gravy. 
I still do cheat, and I have it on Saturday and Sunday mornings. That's not cheating. Well. This card, y'all. I love this card. Card number one is done. The thing I love about it is we are we so many times think we have to like build inside the circle, and I love that they didn't do that at all. I love this card. I love this whole pack. It's so up my. Did I say we're giving this away at the end? What I'm assembling tonight, we're giving away. Um, do we? Ha we don't have an extra sticker sheet, but I'm gonna give away the leftovers and what I'm making tonight. There we go. That's one. We're getting close to a giveaway. Card two. Wishing you joy. I wish you joy. This happened to me last week, too. All right. Wishing you joy. It's this pretty little thing it right there. It is so cute. That one right there. So you're going to go from sheet one and trim the 4.25. We got a subscriber, Sherry Reeves. Oh, Thank you so yay, much Sherry. for subscribing. Um, what's the purpose of the powder on the sticker? It takes the sticky off. So whenever you, um, when you're going to foam adhesive a sticker, you don't want it to have the adhesive because it'll stick down and look kind of funny. But since I stuck mine straight down, um, all I did was powder it on the part that hung off the die cut, and that's it. And and that's up to you. <laughs> so I think it's the floral red black dot piece. This dude. And then you're going to adhere it to the center of a card front, opening at the right. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's a pretty piece. It is pretty. Does it? Oh, I see. All right. It doesn't go to the plaid. It stops at the plaid. Yeah. So if you're cutting with me, be careful. Stop at that plaid. It was a simple card. Y'all know me. I like simple. I don't like when it's too difficult. Too many steps. Too much. I just want to make nice, simple, quick cards people will enjoy getting. And move on. All right. What I was doing there was trying to cut it just to the line that I'd made. So I would not have to. Um, so I wouldn't cut into something else. All right. I got it. All right, you're going to adhere that to the center of a card front, opening at the right. I like that they say that, too, because it lets you know. They are they're doing a lot better with that. The instructions are good. All right, so we're going to lay this one down. I'm going to crease it. I'm going to crease it. All right. Straight down. It didn't even say foam. It did not say foam. Just adhere. The glue's running again. Yay, glue. Uh, dots on the bottom. Oh, okay, I did. Just making sure. So this one doesn't cover the whole front. It has a little edge. Yeah, it's pretty. It is pretty. All right, next, you're going to locate the plaid scallop border strip sticker and adhere it across the front over the seam where the two patterns meet. It's that pretty little plaid. I hate looking for stickers, so I always feel like I don't put them in the camera because I'm like, y'all are looking at them before I find them. Like, there it is, there it it's is, like there it right is. right there. <laughs> now, where is it going? Across the seam. Does it cover the whole page or just the cut apart? Let me see. Um, just the cut part. Just the cut. All right. So we'll lay that down. Isn't that cute? And look, I love this because so many people won't do this. But look, floral, plaid, dot. Y'all know that's love my, that's it. so me. I love that. All right. Now you're going to locate the floral spray on your sticker sheet. The gray label, the floral spray is that. I was gonna say that's the only thing, thing I see that resembles joy. a floral spray is this. Uh, the gray label. The big one. Um, it says "Wishing You." Oh, wishing you right here. Um, and the joy stickers. The joy sticker. Oh, the I don't big know joy. why they said sticker. Oh, joy stickers because you're doing all of those stickers. Okay, I'm gonna lay these down. Is there a dot for the joy for the J? Um, no. No, there's not. No, no, there's not. Okay, now what? All right, it says to apply baby powder to the back. Um, and then it says to layer the label and the floral spray together as shown and adhere to the center of the card using foam adhesive. All right, listen, y'all. Listen, Linda. Something touched my head. What was that? It was the glasses. I don't want to. I don't want to do all That'd that be with too this. Too hard to foam. I mean, with my little foam, would be yeah, fine. But, anyway, but I don't want yeah, to. I'm gonna stick it straight down. So let me see the picture so I can know where it's going. All right. So let's say I did. I guess the Just I need don't to put. Forget your grace. I need to put this down first. Yeah, so it's yeah. label. Yeah, you're floral spray. Let me see how. Layer the label and floral spray together as shown. Like and stick so. Stick it to the front of your card. Okay. And that goes to the front of the card. I'm going to put it like here-ish. Okay. 
Then adhere the joy sticker across the bottom half of the card using foam adhesive or just stick it down. It's a sticker. And ta-da! That is so cute. It is so pretty. So cute. So we've made two cards. Look at this. Really quickly. It's 6.15. We gave away two prizes and made two cards. We're here, y'all. We're trying not to be here all night. We're here. It's Friday night. You want to hang out, but you don't be here all night. So there we go. There's two cards. That means it's time for the spinny wheel. Willow says, I think they were drinking when they came up with that direction. <laughs> it's time for the spinny wheel. Let me do this. Let me show you the prizes we're going to give away or what we'll be drawing from. So let's go back. We gave that away. So we're going to pull this stamp set over. Oh, a new 12 by 12. Look, everyday <laughs> card kit. So the everyday card kit or that... Um, Christmas stitch shape stamp set or the lapel pin. So here's the deal. I'm looking at the viewers. There are 474 viewers. So we're going to be looking for commenters number 47 and 48. And the word you have to say is stamp. So type stamp. the word stamp and commenters number 47 and 48 are, are who we'll draw from. So type the word stamp. All right, so I'm gonna bring up the spinning wheel again. And while I'm doing that, somebody asked earlier, what does it mean if you subscribe? It just means you you subscribe to my channel. So when I put up a video, it'll come into your subscription feed on YouTube. It's free. There's no, there's no fee for that. And you can just be a subscriber. All right, I see stamp set. All right, there we go. Oh. There it goes. All right, she's got it. You can stop typing now. She's got plenty. And, and uh, Shannon's gonna start counting for us. So I love the spinning wheel. All right, so you'll notice on the spinny wheel, we've got stamp set, paper pack, lapel pin. And so one lucky winner, actually two of you, we're going to draw from you real quick. You can stop typing. She's got 47. <laughs> there we go. It's slowing down. And we'll see what you win. The spinny wheel makes it easy and it makes it faster. I love Granny. We'll bring Granny back too. If y'all have never played Granny, but we'll bring it back. They not Darn. stopping. No, and it jumped. In the middle of counting. All right, you got to stop so she can count. Or there's not going to be a winner. They're stopping. <laughs> They're stopping. Yeah, whenever I tell you that she's got enough, if you'll stop typing then, it'll help get the count done. 474. Can we get to 600 viewers tonight? I don't think I've ever had 600 live viewers at one time. Can we do that? I want to get there. <laughs> I think it'll be fun. Jenny's having fun. I'm glad you're having fun. While she's doing that in the chat, tell me if you've made, if you're making this kit with me, are you caught up? Have you got those two cards made? They were super easy, so you should. Stella. 47 and 48. Yes, yeah, Stella that Spinster. That's cute. Our little star is Stella Spinster. I like it. Stella Spinster. Um, all right, so we have number 47 and 48. So Shana's going to tell me the name of number 47. Tina Rogers. Tina Rogers, type the word here to let me know you're here. And as soon as I see you type here, oh yeah, and 600 lights, I'll take it. Um, as soon as I see the word here, I will spin the wheel and we will see what you win. So, oh good. Let me see. I don't see it. I don't see it. Where's the here word? Oh, Tina. <laughs> it takes a minute. There's a delay. Oh, I know. She's typing. She's a typing. What's going on? We're doing a giveaway. We're fixing to give away a fun prize. There it is. All right, Tina's here. We're going to spin the wheel for you, Tina. Here we go. Boom. She's a spinning. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. You got Stella. I like Stella. I like Stella, too. Stella Maybe it should be wheel. Stellar. Because she's stellar, and it sounds southern. Paper pack, look at you, Tina. You just won this everyday card kit. That's so cool. Everyday so that's going on with you. All you need kit. to do, Tina, is to email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com and let her know your mailing address, and that'll go in the mail to you. All right, I'm moving that one aside. I got to bring in another paper pack in case somebody wins this one on the, sec on the second spin. And here's the one we're giving away now, the Astro Bright pack. And look how thick it is. Look how much you get. So I'm going to put that one down. So that's the paper pack here. And then I'm going to put down my stamp set. And then I'm going to put down my lapel pen. Okay. So who is our second winner? Our second winner is Lisa Cleary. Lisa Cleary. Type the word here. You guys keep coming up with better names. Starla. I think I like Stellar. No? Do I like Stellar? I like 
Stella. Stella or Starla? You like Stella. Stella. Stella? Better than Starla? I like Stella Star. Stella Star. All right, are you looking for the here? Oh, oh, is that the right one? Uh, Lisa Cleary. Lisa Cleary. I saw here, I didn't know. Lisa Cleary, type the word here for us, and when you do, I'm going to spin the wheel. As soon as I see you do it. As soon as I see you do it. There, no. Lisa, there you are. Here we go, Lisa. Yay, this is yours. Lisa. Spinning the wheel. Let's see what you win. Spinny, spinny, spinny. Did we sing the song? Go Stellar, go Stellar. Go. <laughs> I like the song. I think it's cute. Go Stellar, go Stellar, go. Let's do it. Let's do it. And stamp set. Yay, you win the stamp set. We get to bring out a new uh, one too. That's stitched shapes. Yep. So Lisa, all you need to do is email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com and give her your address and we'll get this in the mail to you. So that one is gone. We gave away, um, that's, yeah, we gave away four prizes. I forget this is the fourth. Come showing it over and over again. We gave away four prizes and it's only 20 after six. We've made two cards, giving away four prizes. I'm liking that. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. All right, let's turn off Stella. We are in Alabama. That's that's where we're from. It's time for card number three. So I'm going to go ahead and fold this card base because I know I'm going to need it. So if you're going with me, grab that. Thank you. I love that stamp set too. All right, so I've folded my card base and now she's going right. to give me instructions. Card number three. Santa, please stop here. Uh... Santa, please stop here. Cute. Isn't he cute. I saw that paper. From sheet one, trim the diagonal strips, stri strips piece. Diagonal strips. Yes, diagonal strips. It's right here, guys, on sheet one. That's the one you're trimming away. By the way, if you're making along with me tonight, know that you will have enough to make more cards. This kit will do eight because they give you eight card bases, but you have plenty to do more cards than that. So did I get that? Almost. Let's see what happens oh, if I do this. You. Almost. All right. um, let me trim off a little bit of red right there. I got a little hangover right there. So there we go. Oh, what a sliver. Took it right off. Okay. All right. Adhere it to the center of the card front opening at the right. For added dimension, cut out the boot print strip and adhere it in place with foam adhesive. What? I like the idea. So, I'm guessing... Read that again. All right. Adhere it to the center of a card front opening at the right. For added dimension... That's incorrect. Cut out the boot print strip and adhere it in place with foam adhesive. But that's incorrect. Yeah. It's open at the bottom. It's a bottom open card. This is a bottom open card. So don't open it at the right. It's at the bottom. Yeah. And what they're saying is, which I'm not going to do because I looked ahead... They're saying you can cut this piece out, glue it down, and then pop that piece up for dimension. I think we have some dimension coming, so I'm not going to do that. I am going to glue this straight down. So it's not a right opening card. It is a bottom opening card. So stick this down on here. Oh, and it fits the whole card. Ooh, Whew, I got it. I didn't put Yay. a lot of glue on, so it locked in quick, y'all. <laughs> All right, then you're going to locate the gray label on the sticker sheet and add baby powder to the back. And then use, using foam adhesive, adhere it to the right side of the card, flush with the top edge. So it's this dude. Yep. And I will do what they're saying because I like the way it lays out. So I'm going to powder it. Uh, Jennifer, we are currently out of this pack. Um, if we're able to get any more in, I'm sure he will try. Um, but I don't know if we'll be able to. And he might. I mean, we're getting kind of close, so we'll yeah. see. It is, it's, I don't know. We'll see. It depends on how many of you want it. Like, if you will email yeah. us and let us know, that lets him know how many you want it. Y'all, I got a backup tonight. Look, so here's my phone that had a birthday 7-4 of 2019. Here's the new one. Well, if we get to it tonight, and we, I don't think we will. We might. But if we get to it tonight, we'll write the new birth date in there. That's Whoop. Terrence's idea. I love it. It really works. Is Terrence here? Um, I haven't seen him. Man, what's he got? A life? Something to do on Friday night? He might. <laughs> he probably has a life. <laughs> I'm using way more foam than I normally would. I would normally cut that in half. I just didn't. I just went just like this. Maybe I'm trying to get to my new roll. I don't know. Possibly. All right, so this one I'm assuming goes over the space. You um, are assuming you adhere it to the right side of the card flush with the top edge. 
but they have a gap, so I have to I come in a little bit. Yeah. So flush with the top edge on the right hand side of the card. Well, that's just cute as it can be. All right, then See, you're gonna locate. This is what I love. I love how it gives me inspiration for other cards. Uh -huh. I love that. Next. All right, you're gonna locate. Well, let me try that again. Locate the black hat. Terrence is here. Gnome. Time out. Hey, Terrence is here. Terrence. He said, "No, I don't," and I'm here watching. <laughs> Terrence, you're like us. Welcome to our life. <laughs> I'm sorry. Locate what? The black hat Santa gnome on the sticker sheet. Look at his legs. And they want you to prop it up with foam adhesive too if you feel like it. I'm not going to do it because I only, I only do one layer per yep. card. Y'all, this is so funny. You wouldn't know this because all y'all all ever see is Vince sitting in the chair on the camera. But Vince has very, like, really pretty legs. Like, his... um. His granddad used to tell him his legs were too pretty for a guy. Like, they're so pretty. He has these, like, thin legs. This reminds me of his little thin legs. <laughs> I tell him all the time, your legs, I'm always jealous because I don't have thin I don't legs. Have thin legs. And he does. And this guy reminds me of him. So, this is this is Gnome Vinny. Vinny Gnome. So, he just goes on this label. Hi, Marsha from Michigan. Huh? Oh, that's cute, Marsha from Michigan. Uh-huh. Is that it? Mary Berry's in Vestavia. Yep, that's it. Mary, how's it going up there? You're so far away. Yep. It feels like you're so far away. That is the cutest card. Y'all, this is a great way to use up your scraps. You don't have to just do one, just They're layers. They're skipping mash for you. <gasps> Y'all love me. <laughs> Look, Terrence. I'm skipping Frasier. I record Frasier. I have, listen, Shannon. Listen, Shannon. I have 185 episodes recorded. Oh, my gosh. And you know how many of those have been I watched? Because my TV 30. will tell me now. 80. 80. Wow. Vince and I watch Frasier. Like, I don't like to watch politics. He likes to watch politics. So I'll go, can we just watch some Frasier first? And we'll probably watch four episodes a night. Yeah, I like to watch Friends. But here's the difference. When you're watching on your, like, fast forwardy deal, you can watch them quick. episode is like 25 minutes. It's not even 25 minutes. It's not sad. even. Because, you know, you've got it's commercial sad how commercial. commercials rip us off. Yeah. <laughs> so it's not even 25 minutes. So we can watch some Frasier. It Card makes me four. happy. Card four. Card four. I told four. Shannon. I said, Shannon, keep me on track. Card four. It is going to be Holly Jolly Christmas. Have a Holly Jolly or Christmas. Holly Jolly. Holly Jolly Christmas. Is it the first one? Holly Jolly Christmas. Oh, I love that one. I've been wanting to do that one. All right. So. From sheet one. Trim the black check black trees piece. Black check black trees. That's what it says. Black check black trees piece. I love this piece. I've been wanting to do it. And then you're going to adhere it to a card front opening at the bottom. They got that one right. Hey, do, I, I'm assuming I get the holly jolly part too, right? The whole, all the way down to the red? Um, let's see what it says. Then from trim sheet one, trim the red, have a holly jolly Christmas strip. So yeah, go on and trim it while you're trimming. Oh, it's telling, okay. I need to get this out of the way. Let me do something. I should have done this in the first place. You guys come and do this with me. I'm going to get this trim off the bottom. Don't need it. Let's get it out of our way. I mean, we might need it, but we don't need it right now. Then I'm going to trim this little Christmas tree out of the way. Don't lose these pieces because you may have to come back to them. So just sit them aside. And then I'm going to trim this off. And like we discussed, I'm going to trim the whole thing right now instead of having to come back to it. There we go. And then I'll trim that red piece off, right? Yes. I'm going to go ahead and I've got a little bit of a sliver I need to get rid of right there. I saw somebody say earlier, that's a great trimmer. It looks like a great trimmer. It is a great trimmer. And the best part is it's the most affordable trimmer you'll put in your stash and you'll use it for years. It's amazing. And if you're interested, Shannon can probably link it at some point while we're chatting. But we have it in our store. If you're new to us, y'all, we're 60 viewers from 600. Oh! <gasps> 60 viewers. Tell everybody. Bring them. Bring them. You know, tell everybody you know. Um, what was I telling them? Oh, about the um, store. If you're new to us, you don't know about our store, we have a website. It's called maymaymadeit.com where we sell craft products and all that good stuff. And so uh, most of the products I'm using tonight come from there. Actually, probably everything I'm using tonight comes from there. This goes straight down. Yes. Um, it, with the bottom opening. When I say straight down, what I mean is, is it covered yeah. the whole thing? I Charlotte, this it, is yeah. so May May colors. If you don't know May May, her colors oh, are yes. black, red, and white. Then from treat, uh, sheet one, not treat one. You want a treat? Um, I want a treat. <laughs> from treat one, you're going to trim the Holly Jolly Christmas strip, which you did. It says to use foam adhesive and adhere it, adhere it to the card front over the seam where the two patterns meet. I'm going to do that because that'll be cute. It will be. 
That'll be cute. Look, I bet every people are like, I love my Cricut trimmer. I guarantee you, everybody in this room would tell you, if they own it, that they love it. It's a great trimmer. It is. A great trimmer. 547. And, and it's not, oh, yay. And it's not the only one I've ever used. I don't want anybody to think that. I've used lots of trimmers. Oh, Susan said we were close to 600, but then it went to 540. Oh, man. That means people came in and went, I'm not watching this woman. <laughs> Stick around. There's giveaways. Oh, after this card. Yeah. Stick around. We get to do Stella again. Stella. Okay. Uh, so, this goes over the scene. Here, over the scene. Right side up where you can read it. This card. <laughs> really? Just making sure. Those are good instructions, y'all. She's so Just helpful. Just making sure. This is a cute card. All right. Now you're going to go to your sticker sheet. Stickers. Oh, and somebody said a minute ago, you can use your media mat, and stickers won't stick to it. Y'all know how I am. I know. I'm just passing it along. <laughs> Thank you. Just passing it along. You're going to locate the five tree stickers. I got them. I was looking at them the whole time. Locate them. I'm going to have to see the picture on these. I'm gonna have, does it tell me to powder them? Because you know I'm well, probably not. Well, you know not. it says powder them. I'm probably not. And then it says to use foam adhesive and layer and adhere them across the black check portion of the card, tucking the trunks under the red strip as shown. So you can just One. tuck them under and stick them without wasting your foam adhesive. Oh, what's that? Thank you so much. We got a super chat Yay, of $10 and it's Ellie. treat money for Shannon. Uh -huh. Y'all are so kind. That's too much ice cream for just me. Can I share it? Oh, you gonna share it. <laughs> What's Stella about? Stella is our spinny wheel. And after we do two cards, we spin the wheel for prizes. That one's too tall. I need to trim that one down a little bit. You guys might need to, too. I just trimmed a little bit of that one off because it was a little bit tall. This is so cute. Aw, Jay, that lady Noah is doing very well. He's, his, he's, he's with Daddy. He's so funny, y'all. Did, did we tell them about the ICs? Oh no, he, um, his grandparents always take him every day before they bring him to me to Burger King and get him a ketchup hamburger and an Icy. And did you and know they give them to him free? They don't. Hold on, we got a yeah. wave. We got to do the wave. <sighs> That's for the super chat. Thank you so much. And he um, never brings mommy an Icy ever. I always ask for one. Or May May. Or May May, but <laughs> especially never mommy. And um, they called or texted on the way yesterday to find out if May May wanted an icy. Kelly, I pulled your order today. I need to start like, <laughs> I need to start like. I need to sign them. I wish I had a card that said May May pulled this. So we, um, y'all know we have like Corona crew, which means like there's five of us. <laughs> and so there's like um, two work at night. Three of us work in the daytime, and we're trying to get all the sale orders out. And today I was pulling orders, and I looked to see, because I, I like to look and see who's buying what. Yeah. I think it's interesting for me, because I never get to see. And I went, oh, look old Kelly Henry. I'm, like, pulling her orders. So that was kind of fun. It is fun. It's still a time. We've, we've, we've become um, masters of all things oh, May Magic. <laughs> we've learned how to do a lot through all this, y'all. Okay, we have this paper pack. We still have the... Astro Brights paper pack, so that'll be our next one. And then we have our Distress enamel pen to give away. And, ooh, this is a good one. And here's the stamp set. This one is thankful, grateful, blessed, perfect for this time of year. We're gonna be giving this one away. So the spinny wheel will decide, and we have 571 viewers right now. So here's what that means. That means I'm gonna give you a word in just a second for you to type. And we're looking for the 57th and 58th commenter to say the word turkey because of thanksgiving thankful grateful blessed turkey is your word so 57th and 58th commenter okay i'll do that stellar is still stella is stellar stella is stellar so are y'all going to sing the song with me go stella go stella go that's what we're going to do whenever she's spinning okay turkey turkey is your word so type turkey turkey Lisa, we don't have any word on when we're going to open back up. We're hoping it won't be too awful much longer, but I really don't know what our what our goal is. We don't know what, what we're looking for, you know? I don't know. All right, turkeys. All right. She's got it, <laughs> and you can stop typing, and it'll take her a second. When you stop typing, it slows the chat down so she can go back and count, because if you keep typing, she can't go count. <laughs> so, all right, so we've got our 
Um, Stella is our star. You see our star in the middle of the screen? She's in the spinny wheel. That's Stella. Um, and we'll sing the song when she's... All right, you can stop typing. Stop typing. It's slowing down now. Oh, it's a big number tonight, too. 57 and 58. So she'll get the names for us, and then we'll know who we're um, spinning for. So whoever we're spinning for can win either the Astro Brights paper pack, the Thankful, Grateful, Blessed stamp set, or the enamel pen. These are so cute. Look at this little enamel pen. So cute. It has a little, you know, the pen on the back. Adorbs. All right, then. She's getting close. I can tell because she gets quiet and she gets serious. And it also means she's had to do it twice because she put her head closer to the screen. Yeah, it jumped. <laughs> When she has to put her head close to the screen, she goes this twice. Our plan might not have been so great. We're trying to do something. We're trying to have parameters to know what we're doing. So, Still look tired. I'm whispering. <laughs> All The pins are not for sale. We're using them for giveaways. We love them. Fifty-seven. Yay! Ooh, five hundred eighty-two viewers. I heard her type fifty-seven. I mean, write fifty-seven's number. I hope she got fifty-eight also. Uh -huh. Okay, so tell us who number fifty-seven is. Anita Blanchett. Anita Blanchett, type here, and when you type here, I'll spin the wheel. So let's go, Anita. Anita. <laughs> Y'all were talking turkey for a long time. <laughs> yeah. She's got the winner on turkey, so you can stop. I got the turkey that. winner. No more turkey. No more turkeys. Anita. Oh, oh Anita. Kelly, you're so sweet. <laughs> we need to outlast the pandemic, too. <laughs> oh, yeah. You're so sweet. I really did. I was like, oh, look, it's Kelly's. And I also pulled, I can't remember, there was another one I pulled that I, oh, I pulled um, Lynn Coleman's order today. Well, there she is. Oh, she just popped up. I pulled <laughs> Lynn's today, too. Anita Blanchett. Oh, there, there she, she is. There she is here. Yay. All right, I'm going to type, I'm going to type, I'm going to spin the wheel. Here we go. Go, Stella, go, Stella, go. Go, Stella, go, Stella, go. Let's see where she lands. Here she goes. All right, y'all listen to Pamela and give this thumbs up. Here we go, here we go, here we go. The paper pack, yay! yay Anita, Anita, you just won the Astro Brights paper pack. It's a big, juicy one, too. You're going to love this one. All right, that's all the paper packs we have tonight. So if it lands on paper pack again, I'll just have to hit spin again. Um, unless, can I edit on the fly? Oh, I don't know. Let's find out. You guys don't mind waiting a second. We're doing great on time, aren't we? Well, it is 6.40, so we've only been at this for 40, 40 minutes. 40 minutes and we're halfway done. And we have four cards left. Let me see if it worked. It worked. Whoop. It worked. Okay, so we'll turn off Stella. There we go. Time to make some cards. Oh, we got one more giveaway. Oh, my bad. My bad. I was thinking sorry. we both. I'm sorry. I forgot number 58. Okay, so I don't have any more paper packs, so now you're either going for this stamp set or the lapel pen. And who is it? You are Pam May. Pam May, type the word here. We've got 606 viewers. <gasps> Yay! That's awesome, y'all. Thank you so much. Oh, Anita Blanchett, email me. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Email Shannon um, at maymaymadeit.com. Oh, some, did she already type here? Well, we just said her name, so no. Yeah, Pam May. Pam May, type the word here, and I will click spin, and we will spin that wheel and see what you win. Which one? Which one? Oh, I took off stamp set. <laughs> I sure did. They just pointed it out to me. I'll fix oh, it. Pat May is here. Sorry. Sorry, Pat. I put Pam down, and it is Pat May. Y'all, did I say it's been a long day? It's been a long day. Fixed it. All right, ready? We're going to spin the it wheel. It is Pat May. Pat May is here. Pat, this is for you. We're going to see which one you get. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. I like that I can edit on the fly. 613 viewers. Wow. 
Stay upset. Yay, Yay good job. So this upset. one. Thankful, grateful, blessed. Thankful, grateful, blessed is yours. So all you need to do, Pat, Pat is to email Shannon May. at maymaymadeit.com. Give her your address. We'll get it in the mail to you. All right. Oh, the next one's a good one. I hope y'all can't see that. You can't see it. Okay. All right. Let's turn this off and make some more cards. Let's make two more. May, may, made it. Are you putting it in there? Yeah. All right. Card number five. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. Where are you? Who do I get to use this? I'm guessing you're doing this cute little ho 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 no i'm not using this i gotta trim this off because i got a little mess up yep. ho 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 stickers. so you want to go ahead and read what we're cutting and then they'll know if they're all right me. from sheet two you're going to trim the floral check white dot piece all right sheet two the floral check white dot piece the black um is that sheet two am i losing my mind from sheet two Trim the floral check. <laughs> is there that sheet, that page on any other sheet besides sheet two? Is that it? That's it. So it's on sheet three. <gasps> check me. They made a boo-boo. Check me. I'm not surprised. That'd be the sheet three. Is that the one we're That's doing? That's the one you want. Well, it says ho, ho, ho. That's Maybe. the only one that says ho, ho, ho. I mean, Read that me. one says... Ho. <laughs> Read a little bit and make sure, because that page is on sheet two. Locate the Polaroid frame Yeah, that's sticker. it. All right. Gosh, I thought it was me. I've made enough mistakes tonight. Nope. All right. So, so this just one. know that your paper pack m might, it, it's probably not sheet three, or sheet two. It's sheet three. I think I have broken my blade. <gasps> I think I did. That's okay. I'm going to switch trimmers. I've nicked it. Oh, that was a that was a long lasting blade too. I've used it for a long time. We'll trade. We'll trade. It's not a biggie, because this girl's got plenty of trimmers. <laughs> and if not, well, it makes me sad though. I can the tell store that I is did close. it. <laughs> well, I can tell I did it. It makes me sad. Okay. Oh, nearly 1 a.m. here in the UK. Ooh, Claire, you're up late or early. Wait, do I go? I go all the way to the dot. Uh, yes. Floral check, white dot. Okay. And then, after you get it cut, I will tell you what's next. Yeah, don't tell me ahead of time. All right. So, be sure to read your instructions well, because we did catch that one. And that's going to happen, because somebody types these. You know what I'm saying? Probably they type the instructions without ever even seeing the paper. They probably type it before they ever finish the whole thing. You know what I'm saying? Oh, thank you, Yvonne. Thank you for subscribing. I just totally... There we go. I don't know why I try to do those little slivers when I can just scissor them. All right, what do I do next? All right, next you're going to adhere it to the center of a card front opening at the right. Let's see if they got that part right. <laughs> I think they got that part right, y'all. Okay, here we go. Opening at the right. As Noah says, we need 188,000 likes. That was so cute. So give us some thumbs up on Thumb, the like. Thumbs up or underneath the video. Yeah. Oh, there y'all go. Start start taking those numbers up. 618. <gasps> Yay. Oh. All right, I got that one glued down. Hobbies. All right, then you're going to locate the Polaroid frame sticker and apply baby powder to the back of it. I'm going to read all this to you can, so you can hear what I'll they do want it. you to I, do. I don't mind popping this up. Well, I might not well, want to. Well, they I might want wanna... you to trim a 24-inch piece of black twine and wrap the twine around the bottom of the frame two to three times and tie it off in a bow on the front left side. Then adhere the frame to the center of a card using foam adhesive. All right, I'm going to do it because if I'm going to put twine on it, I yeah. will pop it up. Do you want to see my crafty crime scene? <laughs> Boom. Boom. So funny. Oh, you killed the Polaroid. Where that comes from is a long time ago I was doing this and I was, um, I had like a gingerbread man or a snowman or something like that that I had to powder. And when I lifted it up, it left a little outline of the little dude. And I was like, oh my goodness, it looks like a crime thing. All right, a 24 inch piece, I think is what you said. Feel right? Yes. 24 inch. And I'm going to wrap it down here at the bottom. Yes. Wrap the twine around the bottom of the frame two to three times and tie it off in a bow on the front left side. 
front left side. Front left. I usually can only get two wraps when they tell me three. But I have to have some room for tying a bow. Oh, I did it. I did it. Look at you. All right, let's tie this bow. Let me show y'all something. If you want to, if you're struggling, like one-handed is kind of rough to do, but if you'll go ahead and start your knot, just get your knot started like so, okay? And then grab your tweezers, your reverse tweezers, the ones you have to squeeze to make them work, and then put it there. That'll hold everything in place so you can tie. Um, Valerie, I'm pretty sure we have the tonic trimmer on order. It is on order. So keep a watch. We're trying to get it back in. All right. So I got a bow. Next. All oh, right. foam. I got to put foam on it. Foam adhesive, and then you're going to stick it to the center of the card front. Foam it up, Scotty. I'm just using my big foam and cutting it down to what I want. Did I get that thin enough? I did. Did. And now I'm going to trim this little piece off and put it somewhere else. Put it up there. Oops, I slipped. Right there. Okay. Let me cut another sliver. Like so. Uh-oh, Miss Miss Joan is yelling, Bobby! <laughs> <laughs> Who's she yelling at? Is Bobby in the room? Bobby's Yeah, hobbies. Bobby's here. 627 viewers. Thank Ooh, you, guys. Come on, now 700. Thank, oh, my <laughs> goodness. Could we do 700? That would be so cool. If we do 700, we got to have 700 likes. The problem is I can't see how many likes we have because my new streaming software doesn't let me see that. So I don't know. I can see well, how many right viewers. Right now it says 334. That's puny, guys. Yeah. Give us some thumbs up. All right. Let me find my bone folder. Not my bone folder. My pokey tool. Here it is. To help me do this. Because I don't want to fight this all night. And this goes to the center of the card. Woo, woo. All 630 of you. Go down there to that thumb <laughs> and like it. Click that thumbs up button. Everybody do it right now. All right. So, center of the card. Center of the card. There she is. There she blows. She's down. Then you're going to locate on the sticker sheet the Ho 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 sticker. And, and you're going to adhere it to the top left corner of the frame using foam adhesive. There's no reason to foam adhesive. The ho 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 up there. This little piece. The ho ho ho, yeah, the ho ho ho. Oh, oh how well. cute. No, I do have to foam adhesive yeah, that. Yeah, you do. Because it's going to lift up over the one I just foamed. Yeah. But I'm not going to powder it. There's no need for that. There's no need for to go crazy over it. <laughs> yeah, the black and white leaf paper is very pretty. This one up, which that one? That one that you're using. Yeah, I that, like that too. It's very pretty. All right, I'm going to put a piece here. Oh, we got our likes up to 406. Y'all are doing you, it. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. All right. I'll put that right to the edge. All right. And then I'm going to lay this over our frame. That's cute. All right. Then you're going to locate the red hat gnome sticker and apply foam adhesive to the center of the sticker and adhere it inside the foam frame opening as shown. Tuck the beard under the black twine. He got feet. <laughs> did I get the wrong one? I did. Oh, I'm glad I looked. Glad I looked. Okay, it's this guy, not this guy. Because you want the, the beard got, guy. That's what I can figure out why you're saying he got feet. He's got feet. All right, I'm going to put some <laughs> foam on the middle of him. He got feet. Yeah, my other guy had feet. I'm like, well, this is not right. I'm going to put a little foam on the middle. I'm not going to powder him because I'm going to use that sticker to uh, my advantage. Yeah, that's sad. Somebody missed the thumbs up and made the mistake and put the thumbs down. Listen, anytime it I happens. get a thumbs down, that's what I tell myself. They didn't mean to. They were trying to click the other one, and they just clicked that one by accident. So it's perfectly fine. I, that's what I tell myself anyway. Y'all, he's super cute. That's super cute. Oh, he is. I love him. All right, we've done. That's yes, five. Precious. We're, We're on to card number six. six. Happy ho, ho, ho. 
All right, I'm going to fold this. Let's see what happy ho 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 is. Red and black dot piece. Red, black dot. What sheet? Um, it says sheet two. Sheet two. Let me see. I'm trying to find it. Oh, this one. I don't think they gave us a picture of that card. From sheet two, trim the red black dot piece and adhere it to the center of a card front. From sheet two, trim the two Santa snowman triangles. It's on sheet three. But, okay, so that must be the happy, oh, it's the happy ho 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 to you. This one. Sorry. Oh, you're that looking one. at a different one? Okay. So I'm getting this. All right. So the red black dot piece. On what sheet? It says on sheet two. It's not. It's on sheet three. So the red black dot piece on sheet three. Let me show you so y'all know. Is that the sparse? Look. Sheet three has the red black dot. Is that the right one? I'm thinking so. And then these two pieces. That one. Yeah, it's on sheet three. Okay. Go to sheet three. Don't go to sheet two. It's hard to see the dots from over here. Yeah, there's dots. They're just really, really hard to see. Yeah. They do mess up sometimes. It happens. It's going to happen. We'll see what happens when they start telling us what to do with the other one, with sheet, with sheet three. I'm interested to see about that. Well, we what shall see. What am I going to do then? What am I going to do then? <laughs> yeah, because here's a sheet three. Trim the red, red black dot piece. Oh no! Oh no! I, maybe Let's we're messing see. up. Okay, I well, don't. We have two sheets of three. I think they just messed up because I'm thinking the Stay Warm doesn't have a red black dot piece. I'm gonna do my this in my trimmer. Has somebody made this kit yet? Are y'all already noticing it? Oh, maybe somebody already does. saw it when they did it. Yeah, you thumb down or unclick. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are cute. All right. Ah. So, if I've done it right, I've got the red, black, red, and the red with black dots, and the two Santa snowman triangles. One this way. Nope, not that way. One this way. And this way. All right, so first, you're going to adhere this uh, the red black dot piece to the center of your card front, opening at the right. I like the plaid on the back. That's very pretty. So, Linda, you've made it. Was it on a different sheet? Did they have the sheet wrong for you? Um, my paper's a little hanging off. I'm going to trim it. <laughs> there we go. All right. And then these get glued straight down? Um, they, let me make sure. Um, it says to use foam adhesive and apply one triangle to the card aligned with the top edge and then, re then repeat on the bottom with a second triangle so that the two points meet in the middle. All right. So the two points meet in the middle. Okay, so Alma says hers were mis mislabeled too. Okay, that makes me feel better. That makes me feel better, okay. Then I wait until you are done. <laughs> yeah, let me catch up. Okay, I got, I'm messy, y'all. I'm sorry, I got to trim this off. I left a little bit of the white up there. All right, so we'll stick this one down. Up here at the top. And then this one. You got to pay attention to your gnome direction. To your gnome direction. Make sure that they're in the right place. Your gnome mans? Yeah, your gnome mans. <laughs> All right, there's that one. All right. 
Then you're going to locate the Happy Ho 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 sticker and apply baby powder to the back and adhere the sticker to the center of the card using foam adhesive to support the left and the right edges. Which I will have to do. Yep. It's the Happy Ho oh, Ho Ho Oh, I was looking for a little you. strip. That's why I was confused earlier because they just said Happy Ho Ho Ho. And okay, so I'm going to put some foam on either side here. I Just a little it. bit. I like the I like this. I'm not as keen on the points. I'm gonna put this here. Am I? Nope. I'm not as keen on the points because like it's cute, but this is it's not really me. I might like it better if I had designed it and done it slightly different, just a little bit different. But I don't know. But I do like it. <laughs> Julian likes the way I craft. It's called lazy craft. <laughs> And I'm so cute. Aw, thanks. I did not even comment on that part. <laughs> well, I she can is understand. So Y'all don't even know, today, um, Jenna had a hairband with her. A little, like, <sighs> braided hairband. And um, we wanted to try it on, but we were scared at first. Because, you know, we didn't know if Jenna, if we should be sharing hair products with Jenna. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just kidding. She knows. But Shannon put it on. It was so cute it on her. It is so cute. So cute. All right, so now. They are quite a bit younger than I am. Is this done? It is done. These cards are easier than usual. They are a lot easier than usual. I and mean, I'm flying through this. Normally it's like 17 steps. These are like almost three and four. I am flying through this. this. Uh, hold hold on. on, how many have we done? That, that, One, no, two, that's a giveaway. Three, four, that's a giveaway. I was gonna tell you, that's two a bases giveaway. Left. 640, 640 Six people. All right, so we're gonna be doing stamp set. And I, did, I told y'all you'd like this one. This one's called Fala La La Mingo. So stamp set called Fala La La Mingo or the enamel pen. So we'll see who gets what. So here's the deal. So there's 640 viewers. That means we're looking for commenters number 64 and 65. And all you have to do is type the word flamingo. Flamingo. <laughs> so type the flamingo. word flamingo. And when I tell you to stop typing, you just stop typing, and then Shannon can count. And then, um, yay, Kelly. She likes the Friday night live stream. That's cool. I agree, Nilda. You don't have this paper in Australia? Well, we ship to Australia, but it's a little expensive. A little expensive. All right, so there it goes, Flamingo. So 64 and 65 that type Flamingo. And I think I might have She's it, got it. She's got it. So you can stop typing. Flamingo. Aren't you glad I didn't make you type Fala Lala Mingo? <laughs> Fala Lala. Oh, Fala Lala. <laughs> I can't do it while she's typing. I mean, while she's counting. I gotta let her count. It may take a minute for her to count this one because she may have to let y'all stop and like scroll back up because. It jumps if she's not careful, so. This is kind of sad. This is, we only have two more cards to do. I'm really shocked. But I like an easy card kit. I'm not complaining, because I'm an easy card kit kind of gal. Oh, I hear she's getting there. Oh, oh. It did not move just oh, then. Oh, it did. Come okay. Back, come back, come back, come back. Oh, okay, it didn't go far. Good. You got them? Yes. Tell me the first one so they can type here. Xavier Hill. Xavier Hill, type here, please. Type here, and I will spin the wheel for you. Type here. I'm going to look for Xavier to type. All right. Good job, y'all. Y'all stop really quick, too. We appreciate it. I can tell. Couldn't you? Uh, mine are still, like, typing up flamingo like crazy. Yeah, but, I mean, not like it's not like flying. I let it wait this time and like fly before I started counting and I think that helped. Probably. <laughs> Barbara speaks into her iPad so if she went follow la mingo, follow la mingo. <laughs> <laughs> Xavier, are you here? Oh, I thought that was Xavier. There, there Xavier, Xavier, yay. yay. All right, here we go. We're going to spin the wheel for you. Boom. Go Stellar, go Stellar, go. I called her go, Stellar. Go, 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 go. Go Stella, go Stella, go. Go, 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 go. That's stop. good. I like it. No, stop. I thought it was stopping. Sorry. No, it's not stopping yet. It's not stopping yet. Go Stella, go stop. 
Stamp set. You got Fala Lala Mingo. That's cool. So, Xavier, all you need to do is email Shannon at MayMayMadeIt.com and tell her your email and she will get, I mean, not your email, tell her your mailing address and she'll get this in the Fala mail to Lala you. Fala Mingo. So, you got Fala Lala Mingo. All right, we got to do another one. So, I need to bring over another stamp set. This is a good one. This is a good one. Look at here. We're going to be doing the Alpha Bold set. Let me get it in the camera for you. So the Alpha Bold set, so you can get your alphabet. Everybody needs to get alphabet and clue to you. You know these books they're making with the cute little words on the end? This is the set you need for that. Oh. Wouldn't that be cute? Let me yeah. Let one. <laughs> be cute, wouldn't it? And it then, would. of course, our little enamel pen. So who's number two? Our number two is Melody Powell. Melody, type the word here. Type the word here. I do want to do the Christmas, isn't the Christmas Memories one, the one that's very vintage? Seems like it is the vintage one. I do want to do that one. You're welcome, Xavier. Make sure you let us know. We have your address, but I think so. double check with us. Make sure. All right. Melanie? Melody. Melody. M-E-L-O-D-Y, Powell. Melody, type the word here so I can click spin. Like the tune. And then I want to know if you're singing. I want to know if you're singing. Go, Stella, go, Stella, go. Go, Stella, go, Stella, go. Books they're making with words on the ends. Yes, um, they make these, they rip the covers off of books, basically, or, and then on the... I'm not going to. I'm going to cover mine with paper. On the edge of the spine, they write like, oh, what does mine say? I can't even remember. I bought some really cute ones. All right, Melody, type the word here. She's probably like, I already did. And I hit enter, and it's not showing. There she is. All right, ready, Yay. Melody? Here we go. I'm going to click spin. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here go, we go. Go, 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 go. Here we go. The lapel pen, you got the little distress pen. It's so cute. I hope you have a collection of these because this is super, super cute to add to your collection. So all you need to do, email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com and let us know your mailing address. Easy enough. Congrats. All right, I'm folding another card base. It's our last two cards. Yep. It's our last two cards. All right, so let me turn off Stella. Oh, not that one. Turn off this one. <laughs> Almost turned me off, which is fine, right? You're like, turn you off. All right, where are we at? All right, we are on Stay Warm, which is going to be Stay Warm. Burr, Stay Warm. It's going to be that cute little thing. Oh, I like that paper. All right, this is where the instructions get a little funny. You're going to, from sheet three, trim the red, black dot piece and adhere it to the center of your card. However, if you look at the Stay Warm Burr card, this is not a red black dot piece. So find this pretty little piece on whatever sheet it is and you're going to adhere it to the front of your card. I think it's this piece from sheet three, the plaid. Yeah, and then we cut this to put on top of it. Yeah, yeah that's what we do. All right, so let's trim this one out. Oh, I've made a mess over here. Double check me, but I think it, I think that's it. Then it says from sheet two, trim the gray check piece and adhere it to the front. I don't get. Oh, they put a black and. Okay, they cover the whole card with the black and red dot piece, oh, and then put all the other pieces on I top got of you. it. Okay. It's so thin, it's hard to see. That was hard to see. So I'm going to go and get my Sorry, gray piece out, and then I'll get that other piece. But it was also on sheet three, wasn't it? Yes. It does I say sheet, sheet three. From sheet three, trim the four and a quarter by five and a half red oh. black dot piece. Adhere it to the center of the card. But guess what? It ain't on there. I mean, there is one on there, but look, sheet two has it. So which one should I get off? Because, I mean, I won't use the one on sheet three again either. I'm going to take this one because I've already cut into this piece rather than cut into my neck, my other piece of sheet three because I'm giving this one away. Yeah. So I can give a whole sheet. Don't blame me. 
So I'm just going to cut this one away. All right. So I just need this little black, I mean red and black dot piece. Then from sheet two, you're also going to, while you're trimming, you're also going to trim the red, black plaid pointed piece. I got that one okay. ready to all trim. Right. I have not trimmed it. But I found I'll, it. I'll let you do all your cutting and then we'll, then we'll stick down. All right. So this one's going to go here. This one's going to go here. This one's going to go on that. Wow. It's a lot of sheets. Well, just confusing. A little confusing. Uh -huh. I'm going to do this with scissors. I think I can do it faster and better. Slice. Oops. <laughs> Maybe not better. <laughs> Maybe faster, but not better. And then I'll do this one with the trimmer now that I can get to it. Now that I can line it up. Yeah, it's okay if you messed up. There's plenty of extra paper pieces. Plenty of you can pieces. make it. Nobody, nobody that you give the card to is going to have the picture of what it was supposed to look like. So yeah, you'll be true. fine. You'll be fine. All right, line us up. Let's go. All right, so you're going to glue the red black dot piece to the center of the card opening at the right. Penny, I did use the one from sheet two. I used sheet two because I, well, let me take that back. I used the sheet I had already cut into. Which? Which, I don't remember, but I didn't want to cut into the other one because I'm giving this away to one of you guys. So I just dug into whichever one I had not, oh, look, it's not the right size. No, it is the right size. I just didn't want to cut another piece because somebody yeah. else could do that. All right, and then this All right. one. From sheet two, you're going to trim the gray check piece and adhere it to the center of the card front. Jillian wants to hit the like button again because we're just sitting here confused. Because <laughs> we're just like, what's going yeah, on? Yeah, that one, yeah, you know what you're doing. What's going on? You know what on? you're doing. Well, sort I'm assuming of. since we couldn't figure that one out, it had a border around it. It did. You are correct. All okay. right. Then from sheet two, you trimmed the red and black plaid pointed piece using foam adhesive. Adhere it to the card front aligned with the top edge. Uh, foam. So I'm foaming this one up. Okay. There. I'm going to cut this in half. I just took this twinkle out of the star and glued them down. Am I going to get to that point? Is she telling me something I need to know? I don't know. I'm lost. A blouse with a collar. It does. <laughs> All right. Flush with which part? The top. Let me see the picture. Oh, at the top. Aligned with the top edge. Of the card, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's stinking cute. It looks like a pocket, kind of. It does. All right. So now you're going to go to your sticker sheet and locate the burr and stay warm label stickers. And it wants you to baby powder the backs and layer and adhere them over the snowflake sticker Hold on. Sorry, I skipped this one. You're going to locate the large white snow snowflake sticker first. Well, I layered these. Yeah, you can layer those. I just layered I them. I accidentally missed a step. All right. Locate the large white snowflake sticker and apply it to the left side of the red and black plaid piece. Y'all be careful with your snowflakes because you can easily tear them. You can easily tear them. Thought it looked like a pocket on a western shirt. It, it does. does. It does. Oops. She is attacked by all the, the little stickers. snowflakes. Okay, I can stick this straight down. I thought I wasn't uh -huh. going to be able to, but the way they have it, it just kind of goes just to the edge here. So that's good. I did not want to have to foam that. Thank you, Photo Play. <laughs> All right. But they tell me to foam this one. Burnt and warm. Uh, apply baby powder, layer, and adhere them over the snowflake aligned with the left edge as shown. No, it does not tell you to foam All right. It. All right. Then you're going to trim a 25-inch piece of black thread, wind it into a loose oh, nest, no. oh, and no. adhere it to the bottom right corner of the card using dry adhesive. Oh, no. This girl ain't doing it. <laughs> Let me see then, that. 
do this if you want. Let me tell you why I'm not doing it. All right, see that? That's the little thread. First off, I don't have thread, I have twine. Secondly, I don't care how I try, mine never looks, it never looks good. I've tried this technique a thousand times and I, I never, it never looks good. And so I'm just not doing so it. So if you like that look, get your black jelly pen and make circles. <laughs> I just, I never it do never it right. Works. I don't like it. All right, so we're gonna skip that cute little piece and locate the snowman sticker and apply baby powder to the back and adhere it, the sticker over the thread nest using foam adhesive. I thread nest. This girl can't do a thread nest. There's some things I can't do. I've tried it. I know how to do it. I've watched people do it. I have, to, and mine never looks good. So we're not doing it. We're just gonna put this little guy on here, just like this. Is that, that where he goes? Cute. Is that yep. Where he goes? I did put the fo the foam on him. He is cute. And like Shannon said, you could stitch around him or something like that, but no, I ain't doing it. It's just as cute. There he is. All right, the All last right. one. The last one, card mm -hmm. eight. Sheet from sheet three, you're gonna trim the solid red piece and adhere it to the center of a card front opening at the bottom. Okay, I've already cut into this one and I see the red, so I'm gonna use this one. Making, I don't know what sheet this is because I cut the little top off. We're making ho. All right. So let's cut this little guy out. Let's flip him around the other way. What I love is they're given a lot, a lot of little sentiments and stuff on this sheet that you don't, that aren't called for. You know, that you can use They've them somewhere else. They've given you a lot of good stuff on a these sheets. A lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. So here's the red piece, right? This is what I was the looking for. Piece. Then what? You're gonna adhere it to the center of the card front, opening at the bottom. Oh, I'm glad they said that. I skip the baby powder a lot. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I do. It just depends. I don't like to put more than one layer of dimension on a card for mailing. So if I've already foamed something up, then I'm just going to stick my sticker straight down. But if I haven't foamed anything up, I might foam it. The other thing I decide, another deciding factor for me is if it's very, very fine cutting for my foam or if my foam dots don't fit it, I'm just going to stick it down. I'm not going to fight it. All right, next you're going to locate sheet three and trim the red white snowflake piece and adhere it to the center of the card front. Okay. So it's this one. I cut the strip off this so I wasn't sure what sheet this was, but I found it, so I'm not gonna worry about what sheet it is. So it's this guy right here. I'm gonna trim this one away. Oh, look at you, Linda. She got the extra sticker sheet and was able to make 29 <gasps> cards. Wow. And a few tags with it. Wow, that's awesome. That is awesome. Shannon. Yes, Melody, I'll tag you. Cool beans, got it. Oh, now I think she said we're supposed to glue this right here in the middle. Sorry, I'll That's be right. right back with you in just a second. All right adhere it to the center of the card front. Done. All right, then from sheet three, you're gonna trim the lights and black piece and adhere it to the center of the card front using foam adhesive. Lights. Let me see it, because this is where I may be. Um, it's oh. got two little thin black. It's it, already trimmed. It. Somehow, in my cutting, it's already been trimmed out. Perfectly. So that goes across. Oh, that's cute. I bet we foam that. Yes, you foam that. I didn't get my corner glued down. Foam that cuteness. There we go. All right. We're almost done with this guy. We almost got him done. We're not going to make it tonight, though. It'll be another time. We ain't gonna get through him. Oh, Kristen, thank you. They go both directions. <laughs> the lights go in both directions. I was like, <laughs> up, down, up, down. <laughs> what, what do I do? What do I do? All right, next on your sticker sheet, you're gonna locate the hoe stickers. That's what it says. The H and the O. <laughs> Sorry. 
I feel like it's bad. It says so, that. It says locate the hoe stickers. <laughs> See? The hoe stickers. Which one is it? Locate the, the hoe stickers. <laughs> Maybe it should have been H and O stickers. Okay. I got them. And you're going to apply baby powder. No, and she's adhere. not. Okay, then you're just going to adhere the stickers to the center of the lights and black piece using foam adhesive. This is, got That's dessert ready, Miss Joan. Up. I would leave for dessert, too. <laughs> this has already popped up on foam. So what you got and straight. where's it at? <laughs> she said, got to go. Hubs has dessert ready. I'm like, Hubs does not make dessert at my house. It's usually dinner. He might make dinner. I'm not sure how to do this. I'm going to do it like that because I don't want his beard hanging too far off. Boom. Is that it? Uh, that is it. Y'all, this is the easiest Echo uh, Echo Park, easiest photo play card kit we've ever put together. <laughs> Shannon, it's 7.15. Joanne wants to know who I'm calling a hoe. <laughs> Nobody. The stickers. The card. The card. All right, let's do this real quick. Let's give away the card kit, and then we'll do our last two stellar drawings. But before I give it away, I want to show you what all's left. So you're going to get all of these cards. That's right, isn't it? Uh huh. Well, you got two here. Yeah. And two more pins. Okay. If we want to. We'll do it. All right. We'll want to. We got time. All right. So look at this. Here's the cards that one lucky winner is going to get. There's all your cards, okay? But you're also going to get the leftover sticker sheets. You're going to get, I'm going to show you what full sheets you'll get. You'll get this full sheet, this full sheet, and this full sheet. Then you're going to get all of these wow. pieces to go with it that you can make lots, lots, lots of things with. I almost want to keep this one buffalo check strip, but I won't. You she even has more. One. I have plenty of them, so I won't keep it. So there, this is going to be your prize for that. So to win this, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. So 636 viewers. So the 63rd person to type ho, ho, ho. 63rd person that types ho, ho, ho gets this guy. Gets the set in the, in the cards I made. There you go. The 63rd person to type ho, ho, ho. Oh, that's sweet, Melody. She said she won't play this round, but she would love it. You guys are welcome. Look, it's very random. It's yes. very random. But I do, I, that is very kind of you. Yay. Yeah, watch the replay because there was some confusion in this one. Oh, yeah. Whoa, that thing just blew. Give it a second. Just give it a second. Okay, she's got it. You can stop typing. typing. She's going to need a second to count those. Somebody typed ha, ha, ha. I bet your um, spell check did it. Okay, I'm a clean. <laughs> I'm going to clean while she, type, while she counts, and then we will give this one away. I think I said the 63rd person. Oh, good. It slowed down. It slowed down. I'm going to have this ready to write the person's name for Shannon. Sorry, y'all. It jumped halfway through. And I start all over. Here she goes. All right, stop typing, please. Oh, good. So you don't have to leave, Miss Joan, but dessert's coming. At least you have something to look forward to. <laughs> What is dessert, Miss Joan? Did you already say it? I missed it. She probably did. I feel like it's chocolate chip cookies. Why do I feel like that? Maybe that's what I want. Oh, thanks, Cat. Thank you. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thanks, Mackie. All right. Mary, don't worry. We still got four giveaways because Shannon just reminded me that I can't count. <laughs> Somehow I did something wrong. I don't know how. All right. The winner of number 63 is Val's Art Lounge. Val's Art Lounge. You are the winner. 
please, you are the winner. Please email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com with your mailing address. And oh, I'm going to send you this. I'm going to send you the cards we made. And I'm also going to send you eight more card bases because you can make eight more cards, but you will need bases since I use those. So if you will just email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com, we will get this in the mail to you. Let me put this aside. I just tagged you. For so. vows. For vows. And now we have like four more to give away because I can't count. Yay, Vals, you're here. You won. Good Email deal. me at Shannon at May May Made It. All right, here's what's left. So we have this stamp set. We're going to give this one away, the Alpha Bold. I've lost my lapel pin. Um, oh, did we give it away and I put it over here? No? Yep. Yeah. Okay. You have it written down, right? Yes. Okay. So we're giving away Alpha Bold or the enamel pin. All right. So I'm going to turn our spinner wheel back on. I'm going to get ready to spin. And I'm going to look at the number. 64. Okay. So we're going to give away four prizes right now because I have four to give away. Okay. So we're going to use number 64, 65, 66, and 67. You write it down. And I'm going to give you a hard word. You have to type to slow it down. Okay. I'm going to give you a hard word. i got to think of a hard word. Let me think of a hard word for you to slow it down. Um, okay, here's, it's not hard, but it's longer. So, 64, 65, 66, and 67th persons to type distress. Distress. That's what you're going to type. Distress. Like, distress. <laughs> All right, we got uh, four to give away. Distress. Just let it fly and then come back to it. So type her in, and then stop. Oh, play this over there with Val's. Oh, for Val's prize. Val's prize. Don't want to forget the instructions. There it comes. Oh, gosh, did you see it? Um, yeah, it's still flying. We'll let it fly for a minute. All right, you can stop typing because I'm sure she's got it. You can stop typing. Somebody type stop right now so I can see what the delay looks like. I just want to see. You're interested to see that? Yeah. Ooh, it's a bunch. I'm so excited we had like 640. What was the highest anybody saw? 645 is pretty cool. I'm excited about that. Nobody typed this dress. I appreciate it. That's funny. At least I think I'm funny. <laughs> Ooh, I want to see that. Let me scroll back. That's a long delay. All right, she's getting them. She's getting them. You might just screenshot and then go back to it. Cool. Oh, 502 likes. I've never been on a video where you had the same likes versus viewers. That would be interesting to see if we could do that. That's cool. All right, winner number one. Is going to be Betty Albright. Betty Albright. Please type the word here. And when I see you type here... I will hit the spinny wheel. Betty Albright. I'm writing it down so I know who to look for because I forget names. It's okay. if We were just doing a test on the stop thing. Yeah, we're through with that. We've got our winner. So, Betty Albright, please type here. Oh, this girl. There she is. She's here. All right, we get to hit the spinny wheel. Here we go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella, go, go, Stella, go, 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 go. go, go, go. <sighs> yeah, Diana, that's kind of a trick. When when the word starts coming in the chat, you start typing it. That's kind of the trick. Yeah, see, my wheel isn't even spinning on mine yet. So. Congratulations, you got the little enamel pin. Yay, so Betty. So cute. So the enamel pin, to get that Miss Betty, all you need to do is email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com and give her your mailing address, and we'll get this in the mail to you. All right, so we still have Alpha Bold to give away and an enamel pin, okay? And so the next winner is? Our next winner is Josephine Rock. Josephine Rock, type here for me, please. And when I say here, I'm going to hit spin. 
Josephine Rock. <laughs> you are cute. Josephine Rock, type here, please. And when you type here, I'm spinning the wheel. Josephine. There she is. Spin. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, 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 go. <laughs> what does that mean? Didn't say the word in past tense. I don't know what that means. CJ, I'm, co I'm confused. Stamp set. Yay. All right, Josephine, so you won Josephine. Alpha Bold. So, Josephine, all you need to do is email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com with your mailing address, and we'll get this in the mail to you. Cool. All right, our last stamp set of the night is this one. This is a great set. I made the most fun card with this. This is called Party Balloons, and they're layered. So you can do the solid balloons, the balloons with the highlight. You can put highlights in your balloons. You can put um, glitter and confetti in your balloons. It's super cute, okay? And also the enamel pen. So who is our third winner? Karna R. Spell that. K-A-R-N-A. -A, and then the letter R. Karna, if you'll type here, as soon as you type here, I am clicking the wheel. As soon as you type it. Distressed or distress? That's what CC was saying. Oh, it, it distress. It did, just distress is what we said to type. Um, I need a cheerleader outfit. <laughs> I was never a cheerleader. Is Miss Karna here? Oh, oh, I said Miss. I don't know. Karna could be anybody, right? I guess. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, Karna, say here. You saw it? You hadn't seen no. it? No. Okay. I thought you saw it. I thought you saw it. There she is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Okay. I'm clicking spin the wheel right now. Ready? Sing it, everybody. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Oh, somebody said we had 679 watching. But right That's now it's cool. 653. What'd you get? What'd you get? What'd you get? You got an enamel pen, a distress pen. All right, Karna, all you need to do is email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com and let her know your mailing address, and we'll get this out to you. All right, we got one more. We're going to give it away one more time. All right. The pen or the stamp set. We're going to give it away one more time. And this person is Carrie F. Carrie F, all you need to do is type the word here. Type the word here and I will spin that wheel. Oh, I do cheer y'all on. You're so sweet, Sharon. Come on, Carrie, where are you at? Cool, Diana did some, she did some crafting while she watched. Yay. Thanks, Kay, you're so sweet. Go, Stella, go, Stella, go. Now they're typing it, I love that. Oh, I'm yawning. Is there a question? I see somebody answer Anoka, but I don't see a Anoka question. Did you see one? Oh, Carrie's here. Okay, here we go. I'm clicking spin. Look for Anoka's question. Here we go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella. Go, Stella. Go. I wish I could say it right when she claps. Go, Stella. Go. Go, Stella. Go. <laughs> I tried to, but it's not working. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I don't see a Anoka question. Oh, it's right on the line, but it is the lapel pin. So you want a lapel pin. So all you got to do, Carrie, is email Shannon at maymaymadeit.com with your mailing address, and we'll get this in the mail to you. Be super fun. How did we do that in an hour and a half? That was really an easy card kit. Yes. Seriously, an easy card kit. We'll definitely do it again. Definitely. We have, we have a lot of stuff coming up. The blue line marks, oh, these right here. Oh, let oh. me close Stella down so we can see what we're talking about. Are you talking about these blue lines? Before I go into the explanation, say yeah or no about that. How do you get the May icon? Well, you join our channel. There is a button on YouTube and you have to do it on your desktop, right? Yes. There's a button on YouTube, it's $4.99 a month 
and we are doing for those members we're doing quarterly crops so it's very much like this except we'll be making a project that we'll send you the instructions for and you'll pull product from your um, own craft room like your own stash and make a project with us um, so it's $4.99 and it's on it's through YouTube so you click the little join button and when you do that you get all those cool little icons and things somebody want to show her the icons I bet Naoka answered me and now I've missed it oh. maybe not she I'm not seeing her oh I, I see your heart Michelle Oh, I'm with you both. I remember when Friday night went fun date night. Now it's stay home alone and craft. Oh, times are changing. Oh, hi, Holly. You're welcome. Oh, not okay. Answered. Okay. Um, okay. So are we good then? We've got the answer. Look at all those um, emojis. <laughs> They're everywhere. New member. Bonnie, thank Bonnie. you. We have a new member. In just a second, she'll pop up on the screen too. Maggie, you do them like emojis. Down below, if you're on a computer, down below where you type at, there's the little smiley face. Oh and you click on that smiley face and it brings up the May May Made It emojis and then the regular emojis. I hope you enjoyed it. It was a short one, but normally they're longer. Like I think our last one, I don't, well, we played Granny. Granny takes That's a lot about longer. Three hours. <laughs> yeah, Granny takes a lot longer. So, um, oh, you found them, Mackie. She found them. Yay. Thank y'all so much. Um, if you're a new member and you don't know, we'll be doing quarterly crops. And our, and when I say crop, it's a craft is what I should say, a craft. Our next one is set, is October the, I'm trusty, not going to say it wrong. Trusty notebook. Give me just a second. Um, October the 17th from 2 to 5 is the first crop. October 17th, 2 to 5. And we'll be putting out a video to let you know. We have videos that will just go to members. We'll put out a video to let you know what the project's going to be. I have something in mind. I think it'll be fun. But it'll be stuff you can do from your stash. And I'll give you, you know, we'll probably put out the video about it like the 1st of October to give you a couple weeks in case you want to gather some stuff or whatever. But um, we'll just use stuff from your stash. Um, to become a member... If you're on a computer, below the screen where the video is, it has where you like, thumbs up, thumbs down, share. Under that, there's join, and you click that join, and it'll pop up another screen, and that's how you do it. It's a $4.99 subscription monthly that you pay to YouTube. Thanks, Alicia. Thank you so much for joining. That's so cool. Don't forget to subscribe. If you would like for your name to pop on the screen, I'll wait a few minutes. If you have not subscribed to my channel, hit that red subscribe button and be sure to click the notification bell, which works sometimes and sometimes doesn't. Gotta love it. She sometimes it does. Asking about the blue arrows on, on the, the blade, blade housing. They tell you where the blade is so you can line it up on whatever you're trying to line it up on. Hey, Dee, thank you so much. Um... Yeah, that tells you where the blade is, so you can start and stop and know where you're cutting. Yeah, we um we talked about that with Granny. We're going to do a spinning wheel like this for Granny, and it'll be like, um instead of the one, two, three like came with Granny, we're going to do it with bigger numbers. But we'll, we may do Granny next time, or maybe we'll do it in the crop. Wow, you guys, thank y'all so much for joining. Yay! Don't forget to subscribe. Remember, I need subscribers. I really want to hit 300,000. Like, it's my thing. Spread the word. Meme will hit 300,000. Bring it, y'all. I never in my life thought I would ever hit 100,000. But now, it seems like every time I get to another point, and I'm like, oh, I'm so close. I want to get 300,000 subscribers so bad. Um, we don't have any more card kits scheduled at the moment. Yeah, I don't. Why? Why don't, don't keep why. going in? Long day. Long day. <laughs> We got to get caught up with some stuff. We do have to get caught up. We've got we've got to get Mary Make It done. So I really can't um, jump in anytime right now. But Kimberly, it's a four ninety nine subscription. There's a button that says Join on your desktop. You can't do it from a. Um, can you do it from your phone? You already said no. Um, I think if you do, you can't do it from an app. Is what I'm f I've figured out so far. I think if you do from like your phone or an iPad, you have to go to your um, browser and do it from a browser instead of doing it from an app. How do you get a stash just by product? 
when I say your stash, it's just stuff you've already collected. Like what I, uh, what I have in mind for the next one is like saying we're going to take a 12 by 12 piece of cardstock and turn it into something and maybe make several of that somethings out of a 12 by 12. Or we might take two, two or three pieces of 12 by 12 and turn it into something. So it'll be stuff you probably already have. Like you're going to need your glue and your trimmers and your standard stuff. But then we'll, um, you know, we'll just use something that you probably already have in your stash. Like it won't be a kit that you're purchasing or anything like that. It'll be something you can do. And I'll make sure I tell you... Um, I'm not 28 from 300,000. I think I must be... 272,000. Yeah, we've got 272,000. So we're 28,000 from 300,000. Um, the trimmer is not in stock right now. They are on order. They just have not come in yet. So keep a watch as I soon as they one. come in. I have one. You want to give one away? If you want to. I got a placeholder. Y'all want to win one? Change trimmer tone that thing. All of them will say trimmer? No, not all of them. <laughs> what else are going to say? I don't know. They'd have to all say trimmer. I would, uh, I would, I would say messages and we'd sell it to you, but I can't do it. So what we'll do, there's 53 viewers. We can use the same rule. 53. The 53rd person. If you're paying attention, I'm going to give away. I have one of these um, hanging as a placeholder. And I'm going to give it away to one lucky person. The 53rd, look, they're all, yes, duh, yes, duh. <laughs> um, the 53rd person, maybe I should make y'all answer a question. As long as it's not too much that I have to ask. <laughs> with a simple answer. Yeah, simple answer. Let me think, let me think, let me think. What's the best way to do it? What's a good juicy way? First person to bring me some ice cream. I guess we could do <laughs> granny. Right now. Do you want to do granny? I don't care. Uh. Trimmer, 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 trimmer. Right. Trimmer. I'm going to do the trimmer. trimmer. I'm just going to do a word. The <laughs> 53rd person to type the word. Oh my gosh. Y'all better stop because I'm just to give you a word. The stop, 53rd stop, stop. person to type the word. I'm going to make it two words, like dun dun. You got to type two words to make it harder, right? Stop typing trimmer because it's not trimmer. It's not trimmer. I'm going to wait till y'all stop typing trimmer because you're messing people up. You're not playing fair. Don't type trimmer. Don't type trimmer. Don't type trimmer. Don't type trimmer. We're don't, not playing granny. Don't type trimmer. <laughs> no trimmer, no granny. We're not doing granny. Y'all are all going to go to timeout. <laughs> Shannon is, she's done <laughs> Oh, they're slowing down. Very good. Very good. Y'all are playing good. fair now. The problem with Granny is she'll take too long. She does. For now. Okay, ready? Here's what you have to type. And this is funny. The 53rd person to type time out. <laughs> time it. out. That's what you got to type. Time out. Time out. The 53rd person to type time out. Let's go. And if you don't do it right, Shannon's going to put you in timeout. <laughs> Rolling on the floor laughing. <laughs> Y'all can tell I have a seven-year-old. <laughs> you couldn't go to timeout. Although we don't use timeout. Do you not? No. Just let it go for a second. Worked. It's never worked for us. Okay, she's got it. You can stop I typing. Think Just I've let got it go 53. for a second. Just let it go for a second. Y'all can stop typing whenever you get ready. She's easily got it. Y'all have really typed it in. Wow. Y'all are excited about this trimmer Y'all going to be real mad if I go in there and I find out that that one was sold. It's not sold. <laughs> oh, me. Uh, uh, it's as fair as we can get, Bo, because there's a lag. And that's why we don't do the first person or the fifth person or the third person. <laughs> All right, you can stop typing. She's a Um We got some new members while we we're doing that. We got Carol Thompson. And who else did we get right here? Who's this new member? Carol and Sherry. Thank you so much. Um, just as just as to uh, kind of let you guys know this situation, the reason we pick a number like we do is because there is a lag. So we pick a, long, a further out number versus saying... The first person to say the word, because then it's not fair. 
but we drag it out and then that's why we let the viewer number tell us what to do so basically we're, we're picking like a number that's 10 percent of the viewership right yeah 53 yeah. or 63 so so we're trying that's what we're trying to do so she's got the winner are we excited do we want to, y'all want to sing it? All right, you got here to do it. Go, Shannon, go, Shannon, go. Go, Shannon, <laughs> go, Shannon, go. I said earlier, okay, let me say something. I said earlier, this is random. And I said that you could play again. I already said it and y'all heard me say it. So, yes, you can win twice tonight. I mean, you can. It's random. Well, it's, yeah. All right, so the winner is... Josephine Rock. Good job, Josephine. Good job. You are a typer. I feel like it's fair. I mean, I mean, it's it's random. It's extremely random. Especially since I wasn't planning to do this one. Oh, you know. And what we'll do in the future, because I know that's going to upset some folks. In the future, we won't let more than you know, we won't let you win more than one time. Remember, we're still feeling this stuff out. So in the future, we won't let you. Don't panic. And we'll make that clear next time. But this time, since I said it didn't matter, because it's random. No, we it never is. know who's going to type what. So there's our winner. Congrats so much. Thank you, Debbie. Thank you. Feels like Friday night football game cheering <laughs> in Alabama for real, because they're gonna be some they're gonna be people in timeout in Alabama. <laughs> and and we will be getting more in, so keep yeah. an eye out because as soon as they come in, we'll let y'all know. So Josephine, right? Josephine Rock. That's what I call Joseph. Josephine. 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 <laughs> Me too. You need to <laughs> you need to email Shannon at May May Made It your address which you already are and we'll get your prize in the mail to you <laughs> you are cool i hope y'all enjoyed it we spent almost two fun. hours together this was a lot of fun i love the spinny thing i love that yes. we'll see what else we can come up with we want to do some fun stuff with you guys and like oh, i said we probably yay, won't be Josephine. doing we probably won't be doing anything like this um until our next crop but there i don't for maybe the reason for that is We've got to get ready for Mary Make It, so it's fixing to be crunch time for that to get those kits out and stuff. So once those hit the mail, we'll have a little more free time, but for now, we don't have a whole lot of free time. Y'all are so Aww, sweet. Oh, they are so sweet. So sweet. All right, we hope you have a great Friday night. I'm going to let Shannon go home to her family. My family's all over the place. One's here. Probably two of them's here. I think I heard Thomas laugh just that now. That sounded like Thomas. Yeah, so a couple of them are here. Vinny's probably at home. So anyway, we love you guys. Have a great Friday night. Bye. And we'll see you next time. Bye now.